Welcome to the introductory tutorial for Urban Life, a premium Joomla template for Joomla 2.5 and Joomla 3. So let's get started here. So let's go ahead and reload the page so we can see this nice animation we have of the logo in the center. As you see, it flies in nice with CSS3 effects. And let's scroll down and check out the website. So as you see, what we've got here is we have a very nice combination of the current design styles, flat and wide width, but with the traditional style of multiple columns and the full layout. So now let's check out the uh, different module positions that this Joomla template has. Up here we have our menu bar left and this is the main menu. As you see, we have a sucker fish drop down. We also include a dual fish drop down that's two columns. Up here on the left, we have the logo, which is easily changeable from the back end of the template administrator. You simply just upload your logo to your site, and then you can grab it from a drop down there and do some settings to it. Over here in what is called the menu bar right two, we have a login button and a search button. And this is just some custom HTML marked up that links to the different components there. Here in the inset, we have our logo that flies in with CSS3 effects. And then here in our left two position, we have a slideshow. This slideshow is powered by our Deluxe News Pro module. And then over here in the user one position, we have a advert, as you see, for placebo. And here in the right four position, we have Deluxe News Pro again. And as you see, we have a two column layout with it with featured articles. And as you see, News Pro is very powerful. You can do slideshows, you can do grid layouts, pretty much anything that you can dream up, you can do with it. So over here, we have user 13. And right here, we have a advert. Then we have our socializer wall with social icons. Then we have the core Joomla archives module. We have another advert, and this is just custom HTML. And then we have some custom HTML see your ad here, you know, because everybody always wants to promote uh, getting your ad on their website. So now we're going to move over into the right four. This is just a Joomla menu, and this is for the categories. Then we have a cover photo of our magazine and that's just a custom HTML with an image. Then we have the ACY mailing module for people to subscribe to your mailing list. ACY mailing has a free version that we've included with the template package and you can always upgrade to their pro version and get a lot more features. Then we have another instance of our news pro here showing more articles. And now as we move down into the user 19 position we have another instance of News Pro, and this is showing the past issues category. So this is showing past issues of the magazine. And we have some nice covers there for you. And then we go ahead and we have some more News Pros down here. And as you see, it's very versatile. We've got user 25, and this is the urban lifestyle category. User 26 has the what's happening, and user 27 has CNBC, as well as the other categories down here. Then if we move over here to right six, we've got the K weather module. This is a free Joomla module that we've included that shows the weather from Yahoo. And then we have latest comments, and this is our Comento wall. Comento is a free comment extension for Joomla, and we've included it with the template along with this wall so you can showcase your latest comments. And then we have upcoming events, and this is from J events. J events is a really nice uh, event manager. So we've made a, got a little module here from their module, and we styled it nicely. And then once you get down into the bottom area, we have bottom one through six here, and these are core Joomla menus. So as you see, we've built them out with a bunch of links. And then in the footer, we have our socializer wall again with some social icons, and then we have our disclaimer down here. So now why don't we take a chance to go over and look at the styles real quick. It's a style one, and then we have uh, style two, where we have a light header, a little bit of a different menu style, and then we have some other colors in here for you. 
very current colors for the times. And then we have style three. I personally really like this one. We have blue in a blue city. And we also have some neat effects here. Hover effects on each one of these items here. And then our fi final style, fi style four. We switch up, switch up the city look with a nice here uh, train station and we've got a nice orange color for you. And very monotone and orange colored area here. So let's go back to style one. Now, Urban Life is a fully responsive template, so let me switch views here and let me show you exactly um, what this is going to look like on mobile devices as well as on the desktop. So for this view, I'm going to show you something pretty interesting. This is actually a different browser than I was using. This is called the Duo Browser. If you're on a Macintosh, I'd suggest you go to the App Store and you find it and you grab it. If you're on a PC, well, let's hope that they come out with one for the PC. Because when designing a website nowadays, it's really helpful not to have to keep resizing your site to see what the mobile is going to look like and what the desktop is going to look like. So this browser actually gives you two views. Here is the view of the home page from the desktop level. And then over here on the side is our view mobile level. So this is what you're going to see when you're on an iPhone or Android or whatever. As you see, everything goes nicely to one column and it's fully responsive. But we can pull this window out and we can see another view, like if we're looking at tablets. So as you see, the template responds nicely. So now we have like two columns here. Come down. And everything responds really nicely. So this is a perfect responsive template. So let's go ahead and check out the sub pages. So here, let's go look at the uh, Joomla content now. And let's go to pages first. And as you see here, we have a nice title. Uh, this is just in the inset position and it's just some custom HTML. And we've added this to certain pages that we want to display a nice little title instead of using, say, the Joomla category title. This gives us a nice background on it. So here's the traditional two column blog layout for Joomla. You can go ahead and check out one of these articles. As you see here, we have the archives and the categories on the left, and then we have your article. And let's check out the blog view. Here's your standard one column blog. And then we have a portfolio view, which we have a three column grid. And then we have our custom portfolio center which gives you a big image in the center and a big article and smaller on the left and the right and four column on the bottom. And then we have our left version, which puts the big image on the left. And then we have the right version. And now we have a photo gallery. The photo gallery is done with our image gallery plugin. Uh, you simply just put your images in a folder and then you put a little tag in the content and boom you've got a nice gallery which has nice uh, model window pop-ups and you can go to the next one and so on. And then the jo core Joomla stuff here we've got your login form, search, web leaks, contact, and the wrapper. And you just check out the login form here to show you it's styled very nicely for the template. And here's the included extensions. So we've got J events. Let's go ahead and check out the event details page. As you see, we're fully compatible with J events. And here's the cat category view. Shows you the category. And then here is the core calendar view. And then let's check out Jump Social. Jump Social is not included with the Jumpstart version or quick start version as you'd call it. But we've gone ahead and we styled it nicely and picked out the base colors and everything to put in here. 
So as you see, it's fully compatible with Jom Social. All you need to do is download Jom Social from jomsocial.org, install it, and you're going to get a nice looking site for Jom Social. And then Kunaina Forum. Kunaina is one of the most popular forums for Joomla. We've gone ahead and done a nice style here for it and made sure that it's fully compatible. We've done a lot of testing with this template to make sure it's compatible with the most popular extensions. And then we have our layout here. And this is something that you might not be familiar with with other template clubs or templates themselves. If you're familiar with Joomla Ecstasy, then you know about them. Our templates are built with regions. And here on the home page, you can see this would be region one. We have region two here, region four, and so on. So let's kind of look at the layout first so you can get a, a little more idea of what's going on here. So each of the regions has a module position in it. And why did we name them regions? Because we wanted you to be able to move things around easily. And you can do that with a menu link, or you can do it from the back end. So this makes it really easy when you're prototyping a site. In fact, even with this template, we found that once we went ahead and changed the region order, we liked some of the styles better than originally. So you might want to try this when you put your site together just to see what different effects you can get. So here's alternative layout one. As you see, everything's the same here on the top, except that bottom area now with the K weather and the news pro is right underneath the top area and you go down and now here is that top area that was there and connected at the bottom now are the issues and then we have another alternative layout here alternative layout two same on the top but now right here we have the latest issues and the bottom area and then we go into what was the top area and let's check out alternative layout three your categories go down and the footer and this is a more minimal so if you don't want to have a lot of content or you don't have a lot of content or you want to minimize it on the home page something like this would be good and then we went ahead and included a demo of a microsite whereas we just have the top area here no slideshow, here's your articles, and done. So I hope you enjoy this template as much as we enjoyed making it, and I'll be back with the administration tutorial video in just a moment. We'll see you next time.